So hi and welcome to this another episode with me Arshane in this video I'm going to talk about MBA colleges in Hyderabad I've recently been to Hyderabad and explored a lot of places out there right from Char Minar to a lot of you know historical monuments but I mean I think you know uh, I've seen during last few years you know Hyderabad being in high tech city a lot of companies are out there right but apart from it a lot of companies which are out there there's so many b schools which are also out there so i mean if you're looking for mba in hyderabad what are colleges you can keep in your list this video is for you so let's get started Coming back to the topic, MBA colleges in Hyderabad, and I'll start with this episode again explaining the same basic thing. Vaise to, you know, the people who live in Hyderabad, they know Hindi also, English also, but the reason being I'm talking in English because a lot of students who are from, let's say, Andhra Pradesh or Kerala might look for colleges in Hyderabad and they don't understand Hindi. So that is the reason of thing, this video specifically in English. So there are two categories of students who are looking for colleges in Hyderabad. One who are might be from Hyderabad or nearby cities which are there. So they are willing to take admission either in Hyderabad or Bangalore, right? That is the two most preferred cities what they look for. Second category of students might be from north or different regions of the country. And they have so many options, right? From Pune, Mumbai, Bangalore and Hyderabad. And out of those options, they need to check that whether they should go for this as an option or whether they should go for other colleges what they have in their list. So if you are also confused, right, that what college you should target as per your profile, because let's say if you have, you know, 98 percentile in CAT, or let's say if you have 80 percentile in CAT, in that case, colleges will definitely vary. I mean, you might be thinking that why it's not top MBA colleges in Hyderabad, because there's nothing like top. For every single student, the top is all total different, right? I mean, if you don't have, you know, 98 percentile, then you can, we cannot say na, that you can get to do uh, like I am Ahmedabad. So for you, top college cannot be I am Ahmedabad. So that is the reason colleges vary from profile to profile. And if you need any help, you can reach out to the description box. There's a form which is called profile analysis form. Fill that form and ask all your questions related to this. Do the same. So coming to the topic that, you know, Hyderabad is home to more than 190 MBA colleges. More than 160 colleges are private and about 30 MBA colleges in Hyderabad are government, right? Talking about the very first college in this list, I think it's one of the most expensive college in the college, which is globally recognized. I've recently reviewed this institution and that is called ISB Hyderabad. They offer a lot of courses, one year courses, and it's very expensive. It's even expensive than colleges like IIMs, right? But the average packages are also quite similar, right? Student with work experience come to all these colleges, diversity, exposure, and all in all, you'll get a lot of opportunities out there. So through GMAT, you can target this specific college and also GRE. It's not a college which is through CAT or the other entrance examination. So if you want to get into ISB Hyderabad, you know, GMAT and GRE is the way you can get into the college. So that is IFHE Hyderabad. This is ICFI University, what we call it. I mean, they have this one known campus in Hyderabad called IBS Hyderabad, a seat intake of more than 1,000 students, if I'm not wrong, right? Secondly, the fee structure is as expensive as near about 20, 21 lakh. And the average package, what I feel like is near about 8, 8.5 lakh. So you can even get companies with an average package of 4 lakh, 5 lakh, to even companies with an average package of 21 lakh, 22 lakh. So there are diversification when it comes to company. But you need to see that, you know, you really want to go to this option or look for other better options out there. Because I reviewed this specific college every single year the time i started this channel the first review what i created was ibs hyderabad i mean there were a lot of comments in the comment section which i still go and check it out uh, to get the reality check uh, i interacted with the guy, guy you know uh, and he specifically told me that the faculties of i you know ibs hyderabad are really really good right so if we keep faculties aside the return in investment is not there right so the only good thing what Apart from campus, the campus is really beautiful. It's very big. That is the faculty's rest. You need to check that, you know, you are looking for a return on investment ROI, uh, you know, wala B school or you're not looking for a ROI wala B school. So that was IBS Hyderabad. Then a lot of colleges like 
NMI must have their campus in Hyderabad. You can target this specific college through, you know, NMAT examination, right? 200 plus is the cutoff, not 200. 200 plus is the cutoff and the average, what they're claiming is near about 9, 10 lakh. Then we have IMT Hyderabad, right? You can target this specific college through CMAT also. And I think they also accept CAT and ZAT. With CAT and ZAT, the, uh, you know, cutoff is near about 70, 75 percentile, right? And through CMAT, they're mentioning, you know, 90 percentile is the cutoff to get into IMT Hyderabad. Their average package is also what they're claiming is near about 9 to 10 lakhs. So, I mean, in Hyderabad, you'll find all the top brands have their baby, you know, colleges out there, right? From, you know, Symbiosis to, you know, Narsi Munji to IMT and lots more. So, I mean, I think all these colleges, ISB, IFHE, IBS, NMI, MS Hyderabad, IMT Hyderabad, then Watson School of Business. I also reviewed this institution. If you haven't checked out, you wanted to know what, how this college is, all you need to do is, you know, go and check the detailed video on this college. So you can even look for this as an option. Then we have CMR College of Engineering and Technology, right? Dhruva College of Management, ICBM School of Business, VJIM, right? So there are so many colleges which are there in Hyderabad overall, right? So the question is, you know, that out of IP Hyderabad is also there, which is not there in this list, right? Now you need to check that, you know, which one to opt for among all those colleges. If you need any help in terms of that, all you need to do is fill the form which is there in the description box, ask all your queries related to the same. And do not forget to share this video with your friends. And for more such videos like this, do not forget to like, share and subscribe. I hope you like this video. For more such videos, keep watching our channel. And do not forget to like, share and subscribe.